Uh, when someone says um, they heard of Herbalife or they make a remark on your Herbalife attire, a button, a button. hat, something like that, mm -hmm. well, I mean, you're out, just out and about, what do you say to them? Short, bulletproof your target so you know what you're going to talk about and keep it simple. Have you tried Herbalife products before? If they say yes or no, I'll take it from there. How much weight do you need to lose? You need more energy. Well, you can lose two to eight pounds a week on Herbalife. You have plenty of energy. And then I take my iPad out, and the first photo is my before photo, 19 pounds heavier. Mm -hmm. okay. And they're like, well, that's your... Yes, that's me just a short while ago. So if you have a testimony that's photographed, it's easier to show someone photos, and then I'll show them photos of Herbalife seminars, events, this is, you know, talking to people in the street or attending well, a seminar. What if you haven't lost... Boot camp. What, what if you just started on the product, you haven't lost weight yet? Okay, for someone that's new on the product, mm -hmm. that wants to get in the business. Brand new. Okay, they need to have their own product testimony or they're not going to do well in the business because your object isn't to sell product. Your object is to get people buying the product. Thanks, Hillary. Buying the product and taking it every day for the rest of their life. It's not about breaking supervisors or going up the marketing plan and go, 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 go. It's about each person, one person at a time that you affect, you can explain how to take the product, how to make a smoothie, and get them taking the product consistently. If you do that massively, you can have a nice check coming in residual income for the rest of your life. I let them know you can lose two to eight pounds a day, and then I would show them a product catalog. And we have programs that are three dollars a day, four dollars a day, or five dollars a day. Okay, what if you, uh, what if somebody asks you about Herbalife but they don't need to lose weight? Because they've heard of the name. Mm -hmm. um, I get a lot of that just from the sport bottle at the gym. People say, oh, Herbalife is great. Have you heard of the sport 24 line? Then I'll talk about our athletic line mm -hmm. for people who like to work out a lot. Or I'll say, if you know of anyone who needs extra income or needs energy or lose weight, here's my flyer. Please have them call me. Now, also on the back, I advertise free smoothie, free boot camp. I'd like to give away a smoothie because that's what Mark was talking. Mark sat me down and told me he built his business with little free smoothie samples. Because if something tastes good, they're like, well, that tastes good. I, I do want that. They'll remember that. People like a free sample of a smoothie. Obviously, you can't do that long distance, but I am a big believer in wearing Herbalife apparel or a button. Mm -hmm. And I carry smoothies uh, like in a little pack, a little ice pack cooler. Uh -huh. I can do that or people come to my house and I make them a smoothie. Okay. Get the get them on the product, liking the product and then you're going to follow up to make okay. sure they're taking the product correctly. All right. So, let's say you are talking to somebody. I mean, how do you close a product how do you, purchase? Easy. You want $3 a day, $4 a day or $5 a day. Do you have any health issues? And how did you want to pay for this? I take cash, check or credit card. However, it is best to order wholesale. Now, I close a lot of people on wholesale and get people signed up because this goes with me every evening bag, every day bag, every suitcase. I'll, sometimes I'll have two or three of these in my calendar, okay? Because if people see the ID number, I would say, well, do you want a wholesale ID number or do you want the product catalog price plus tax shipping and handling? Okay. You're going to save 25 to 50% off from the catalog price, so they still have to pay the tax shipping and handling. But you're going to need a wholesale ID number. Now, this is a distributor app. They don't have to distribute the product. They can just sign up to buy wholesale. But you have to show them what this is. And I like to fill it out. You can still get the application online, but you will sign somebody up much faster. As you know, you signed up two people today. <laughs> and did you show I did. them this? I showed them the application. Okay, and, and one man wants to open a nutrition club. Great. Okay. Okay, great. What else? Okay, so once someone has started on the product, um, how do you basically follow up with a brand new customer that's using the product? Immediately. I like to call people early in the morning because if they hear my voice early in the morning, it's with them all day. So try to call somebody first thing in the morning. And if I don't get a hold of them, I email, I Facebook, I text. I make sure I get a hold of the customer. I personally call a new person three times that first week. If they can't speak because they're working, is it okay that I text you? And then on a customer care card, I'll write out what time they like to be phoned. 
Okay, and now when you do talk to them, text them, email them, what do you ask them? First question, what did you mix your smoothie powder with? Okay. I don't say shake because shake is <coughs> a slip dress. It's not a smoothie powder is a smoothie. Okay. And then I ask them what they mixed it with. Okay, so I mixed it with uh, milk and fruit. How did how did it taste? Um, let's say, uh, you know, it was okay. It was just okay. Well, why did you make an okay smoothie? I mean, how did you make it? I made it the same way that that you told me to. Well, and how did I tell you to make it? Shake the can, put the powder in. <laughs> Say that. No, you didn't make it right, okay? <laughs> if a smoothie doesn't taste good, they did not make it correctly, okay? okay so can you First share of all, how to this make is a how you shake a can. Now, show, show me how you shake a can. <laughs> you shake it upside down because there's vitamin, mineral, herbs that are weighing all this powder down. Okay. Sometimes I'll, I've sold programs to people that go, well, I'm still hungry. Did you shake the can upside down? No. Because all the important things are at the bottom. You have to shake it upside down. So it's, got it. You know, well, it's nutritionally sound from top to bottom. <laughs> I like so that. Know, nutritionally okay. sound from top to bottom. <laughs> okay, so then use your scoop or take your two scoops. So I suggest a coconut milk, a soy milk. I mix mine with water, a little frozen fruit. But most importantly, if it's a chalky taste, mm -hmm. it's not Herbalife. It's because they don't know how to make a smoothie. Water first. Because if the powder hits the blade first, you're going to have a chalky tasting shake. You need to have water first in the blender, and then your fruit or ice, and then your powder on top, and then you blend. After you're finished blending, you add a lot of ice to make it more like a milkshake. So it's really thick, okay. because you will lose weight faster with a colder protein smoothie than you will a room temperature smoothie. And that's because your body needs to work harder at metabolizing something that is cold and bring it to your body temperature or your room temperature. You're going to regret your Santa better than I am. <laughs> exactly. That's what I was Well, I say. learned it from a nurse just... at one of my trainings. Okay, good. Okay. <laughs> All right, let's see. Um, do we have time for one more question? Yeah, just, to, just so you know, the, the, we have other products. If someone is lactose intolerant or they want an allergen-free we have a sport product as well. But this is our best seller, what comes in the, the starter kit, the okay. distributor kit. Um, one, more, one more question before we go on to okay. the, the, the next section. Uh, so when you're following up with your customers, how do you get them to give you referrals? Because you're very good at retailing the product and getting referrals from your customers. I ask. <laughs> Are, are any of your family or friends noticing your weight loss? And if they said yes, I said, well, great, because I appreciate referrals. And is there anyone you'd like me to contact? Well, they usually say my sister, my neighbor. I said, well, you know, you can make money by selling the products yourself to them, or you can sign them up. I said, would you like me to do a demonstration or come, come to your office? And usually they'll say, no, no, I'm going to sell it. People that had no idea they were ever going to sell a product, mm -hmm. just like myself, I never thought of becoming a president team at Herbalife. I thought, boy, I can make $200 a week. I can buy I don't know, Herbalife a lot. I just wanted enough clients to pay for my own product. Mm -hmm. But when I went to the meetings and seminars, I elevated my desires on my future income. I thought, I can do this. All right. So you. people will start becoming distributors if you ask them for referrals. Okay. And then people say, well, call. there are some people who do not want to distribute. It's not their lifestyle. They don't want to. I have no problem getting the next person. Okay, great. All right, thanks a lot, and we'll see you in the next section.